everyone, it's Brittany. Welcome back to my channel. Today, I feel like I probably look like a bit of a floating head because I decided to wear white and everything in my background is white. But this hat is very appropriate for this video because it says naughty or nice and I'm doing my Amazon Christmas wish list. I have done a Christmas wish list before, I think about two years ago. I don't remember if I did one last year, but I wanted to kind of do a different version where I was just talking about Amazon items because they can be really accessible to everybody. You can ship them directly to whoever you're buying for. I'm doing this more so to help you guys out with thinking of ideas to get for people. I will be doing a separate gift guide video and this is also to help you if you have people asking what to get you for Christmas and you don't know what. These are some really cool ideas that I hope to inspire you with. So if you are new to my channel, make sure you subscribe and let's go ahead and get started with my Amazon Christmas wish list. For this part of the video, I'm going to sit over here off to the side so that I can insert pictures of what I'm talking about in this area, and I will also have everything listed in the description box below. The first thing on my Amazon Christmas wish list is a wine tumbler. Obviously, these don't have to be used for wine, but I do think they are really cute, especially if you were just like taking a little bit to a friend's house and you don't want to bring the whole bottle. I think that this is a really good idea. They have so many different colors. The ones that I really like are from a brand called Simple modern they have a variety of sizes too which is awesome and they also have like a wine bundle so it comes with like the wine bottle shape and then two of the tumblers which would be good if you're making like sangria or something and you want to take it over to a friend's house and make sure it doesn't spill anywhere I just think they're really cute it's something that I probably wouldn't buy for myself so that's why I'm putting it out there into the world for anybody who wants to get me things <laughs> next on my list is something that I accidentally came across on Amazon and as soon as I saw it I was like this is really cool. I'm sure most of you are familiar with the vanity mirrors that have the lights along the side of the mirrors. Well, this is something that you can use to make any mirror into one of those vanity light mirrors. So they are little light bulbs that actually stick to the sides so that you can actually have like really good lighting in whatever area that you might be doing your makeup or getting ready, doing your hair in. I just thought it was a really cool idea. I could turn any mirror into a makeup vanity. I think that my next item on this list would be a really good stocking stuffer. It's very affordable. It's also great for anybody who likes to look at their phone when they're getting ready. This is from the brand called Air Stick, and it is a mirror mountable reusable micro suction phone or tablet holder. This just sticks onto your mirror so you can actually see your phone as you're getting ready. You don't have to keep like going over to a different section. I also like to watch Netflix shows while I'm getting ready and I don't like to constantly have my head turned, especially if I'm doing like makeup up her hair so it's like a really weird thing probably to ask for but I think that it would be really handy also if you have like an Instagram account or you like to do live get ready with me videos or any type of stories then I think it would be really useful to just have it there and then you don't need to hold the phone I made sure to add this item onto my Christmas wish list this year you can get this at Michaels but I also found out that it's available on Amazon so if you don't live close to a Michaels you can totally just order this and that is a me and my big ideas happy planner. I use mine all the time. Honestly, if I didn't write things down, I would completely forget about it. So I have a lot of things like a lot of events, friends' birthdays. Well, I shouldn't forget their birthdays, but you know what I mean? Different events maybe for friends' birthdays. I like to write down. I don't want to forget things like that. So I really like to have a planner. It makes my life so much easier and they have a bunch of really cute designs on the Amazon website. So definitely check those out if you are interested in getting a new planner. I've been using mine for the past year and it's really great. Next year I will be moving into a different space and I really want an iRobot Roomba vacuum cleaner. <laughs> I really don't like vacuuming. I don't want to do that so it would be so much easier if I just had an iRobot Roomba vacuum cleaner. It's a really big thing to put on my Christmas list. Honestly I probably won't get it this year but I like just kind of sharing things that I do want. Doesn't mean I'm gonna get them. I'm sure whoever receives this would love it. I I have been wanting one for so long, so one day. Since I do edit all the time, I'm on my computer 
every single day and I'm looking at the computer screen that has the blue light in it that's not good for your eyes. So I have heard people talking about these glasses that block the blue light. It seems really cool. I think it would be really nice, especially for people who edit on their computer or who are on their computer all day long for a job, whatever it is. I think it'll be so much better. It's supposed to help prevent getting headaches from looking at a computer screen all day and they have a bunch of different styles. The ones that I like are from a brand called T-I-J-N. They have obviously different colors and different shapes and things. So I thought that I would add it. I think they look really cute and I would totally wear them. The next thing on my wish list is something that anybody who wears makeup and uses a beauty blender is going to love. I want one, especially for traveling because anytime you travel with a beauty blender, it is most of the time damp after you've been using it all week and you need to go back home. So this is actually a travel case for a beauty blender. It's from a brand called Blenderell and it's a hard case. So I have a soft like mesh case, which doesn't do really much for keeping the shape, especially if you have it packed in with a bunch of other stuff. I wanted something that would actually protect it more and can actually still let the beauty blender dry and air out. At this moment, I think they have them in gold and black. I think I've seen people get them in rose gold. So maybe from a different website, maybe not Amazon, but if you were just looking to get one of those, then definitely check it out. I think it's going to be awesome. And I really hope I get one this year. This year, I have been building my collection of board games. I really love to have board games. I love playing them. A bunch of my friends love playing them. So preparing for moving into a new space in the new year, I wanted to ask for a few more games. The first one that I really wanted to try is called Codenames. It literally has five stars on Amazon and over 2000 ratings. So I thought that seemed pretty good. I've never played it before, but it seems like it's good and has good reviews. The other game that I'm interested in that I found while I was scrolling through Amazon is called Trick Question. In the description, it says, welcome to Trick Question, the party game where things never mean quite what they seem. It's supposed to be like a fun game that you can play with anybody. So I thought that it might be nice to add to my little game collection. And the last two things on my Christmas wish list from Amazon are books. And I really like a specific type of book for actually buying it physically. And that is books about like party planning and like fitness books and things like that. So I actually found two books that seemed like they would be really fun to have in person physically. Both of them are kind of like related to party planning and it's even just like for your friends and family, nothing too big. The first book is by Courtney Whitmore. It's called Zazzery, entertain in style, tablescapes and recipes for the modern hostess. And it just looks like such a cute book. I definitely want to get that one. And the second book that I have is called So Much to Celebrate, Entertaining the Ones You Love the Whole Year Through. This one is by Katie Jacobs. It is also one of those entertaining party planning type ideas, but her book is more so seasonal. It also has suggestions for creative party themes, different decor ideas, recipes. I'm a huge fan of books like that, especially to have them physically in person and you can display them because most of the time they look really cute and it's also nice to kind of have in your kitchen if you wanted some recipes to start making quickly if you do have friends or family coming over. So those are all of the things that I have on my Amazon Christmas wish list for 2018. I hope you guys enjoyed this type of video and I also hope it inspired you for getting ideas for people if you wanted to buy some of these things for friends or family and also maybe something to ask for for yourself. I did mention that I also will be doing a Christmas gift guide as well so I will have things for men and women, whatever it is, I will try to throw in a bunch of different types of things for ideas that you can get people for Christmas. That video will be coming soon, so definitely stay tuned. So everything will be listed below in the description box, and thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you did definitely enjoy it. If you are new, like I said, subscribe. It is free. I upload every single week, and I do cruelty-free beauty, lifestyle, fashion videos. So I hope you are having an amazing day, and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.